Hey, I want to tell you about a really, um, I'm, I'm excited about this set of songs and a lot of them like that because what you, uh, you if you know much about me, you know that one of the, my favorite things to play on the guitar are instrumentals and particularly complex instrumentals, which frequently means difficult ones. And uh, of course, that's my second favorite thing to do. My first favorite thing to do really is teaching guitar. Second to that though, I like playing difficult songs. And what we have here is a set of really difficult songs. I've been working on putting together our packages of uh, advanced finger picking solos. And here we have volume three. And um, these now, of course, all these songs are available as part of our, our subscription programs, which you can get into for really cheap. But here is a, uh, you know, a way to this could be I'm, I was going to say a year's a thing to keep something to keep you busy for a year or two could be a lifetime because what we have here are some of the biggest war horse pieces I have ever put lessons together on. Um, that is one of them. That is James by Pat Metheny. Beautiful tune. Catchy. Oh man, love it. Um, what else is in here uh, are some other, well, let's see, White Bird, which offers all kinds of its own challenges. Very long, complex tune. Blues Land by um, Jerry Reed. And um, a couple other really, really odd ones. The, well, this, I shouldn't even try this. This, I, oh, what the heck. There we go. Yes, Pipeline, my solo arrangement of Pipeline. That is what else is in here. Along with a couple Scott Joplin tunes, uh, The Entertainer, which is in drop D, but I'm sure you know the tune. That's a really simplified version. The version I have is quite difficult. And another beautiful Joplin tune, Heliotrope Bouquet. figure out what it is. I got a B flat, a G, a C sharp, and an F sharp. Do we think of it as an A sharp? Oh, worry about it later. Anyway, uh, so that's what's in here. Six really difficult tunes. Advanced finger picking solos, volume three. There's a lot more information down the page, and of course this is available for less than half of what it costs to get all the tunes individually. So um, if you want to be wrapped up in some really difficult tunes, be sure to check out Volume 2 as well, which had some progressive rock classics in it, like Eye in the Sky, Borderline Progressive Rock. Um, but of course then Steve Howe's tune, Clap and Mood for a Day, and some Greg Lake tunes, Trilogy and stuff like that. That's all in Volume 2. Now, Volume 1's been around for a really long time and has 10 tunes in it. So um, anyway, if you're looking for big challenges, be sure to check out my series, our series, the Totally Guitars series of advanced finger picking solos.